Imagine that you are in a car moving at a speed of 54 km per hour. Then what distance will it cover in 10 seconds? Hello, I'm Vinod Kumar. Our concept for now is time and distance. Have you ever booked a Ola ride? If you have, you might have known the time and the distance. How did we know that? Come on, let's figure it out. Time and distance. In time and distance, there are few important points which are to be memorized. We already know that speed is equal to distance by time. And time is equal to distance by speed. And we also know that Distance is equal to speed into time. For the conversion from x kilometers per hour to x meters per second, the value should be multiplied by 5 by 18. That is x into 5 by 18 meters per second and vice versa that is if it should be converted from x meters per second to x kilometers per second then it is x into 18 by 5 kilometers per hour if a is to b is the ratio of speed of a and b then time taken ratio is 1 by a is to 1 by b that is b is to a. For example, a man covered half a distance with x kilometers per hour and the other half with y kilometer per hour. The average speed calculated by 2x by x plus y kilometers per hour. These points are to be memorized. Let's look into a basic question. Here is a basic question. Here he asked how many minutes does a man take? To cover a distance of 400 meters and run with a speed of 20 km per hour. That is, a man is running with 20 km per hour and he covered 400 meters of distance. In how much time? So, let's solve this. Man's speed is, is 20 km per hour. That is, we need to convert into meters per second and therefore it is 20 into 5 by 18 that is 50 by 9 meters per second now time taken how can we calculate the time taken that is time taken that is we already know the formula time is equal to distance by speed and therefore it is 400 into 9 by 50 and its units are seconds that is equal to 72 seconds and when converted into minutes we get it as 1 1 by 5 minutes we are done with the first model of time and distance